Hi, in this tutorial we are going to go over how to edit a basic page within the Joomla CMS system. This is our website thirddesign.com that uses the Joomla content management system. As you can see the content management system is quite versatile and can fit any design required. So let's look at how we can edit a basic page like the web design page over here. There are a few elements to this page that cannot be edited or we would advise you to get in touch with your developer to edit for you. Elements such as the banner of the page which is here or the menu items on the left hand side of the page. It is possible to edit these these items on the page however we would advise you to get back to your developer in order to update these items. What we are going to look at editing right now is the main content area of the page as highlighted here. This is the main content area of the page where most of the content lives and can be edited and updated by the site user. So let's look at doing this now. The very first thing I do is log in to the backend of the Joomla CMS, which is easily located at your site name forward slash administrator. Once I enter this, I am brought to the Joomla login page. I enter my username and password and click login. Once I log in, I'm greeted by the Joomla CMS um, interface. Do not be alarmed if you don't see all of these icons right here. I have a high level of access, so I'm seeing more than your average user would. However, you should have access to the Article Manager tab, which is pre present right here. If I click on the Article Manager tab, I am brought to a page where I can see all the articles within the website itself. I can also access the article manager section of the website by simply going to content article manager. Once I'm in here I'm re I also have tools such as filter in order to find particular pages. I can change the class I can uh, search for articles via section. So if I've created a section previously I can filter the articles by choosing appropriate sections and appropriate categories that fall within that particular section. This is an easy and convenient way to find content within the website also. But let me show you an easier way to find content. If I pop back to the front end of the website and go to a page that we want to update text into. I simply look for the title of the page which is Great Web Design Melbourne. Highlight it, click on Control C, copy it. Flip back to the main back end of the website and I'm already in Article Manager. In the Filter tab I just select the title and click Go. And there you have it it's brought up the, pa the page I am after. So let's now click on this page and see how easy it is to update text. Once I click on the link it brings up the text from, for me to edit. This is an easy WYSIWYG editor that is brought up by the content manager by the Joomla system. I've pre-installed a WYSIWYG editor called JCE which is quite a good tool to use in Joomla. So now once I'm in this page right here I simply I can add text, delete text as I wish or use a range of tools that are currently present over here. Most of these tools over here are very similar to what you'd find in uh, Word except they, are, they all create web friendly HTML tags. If you are copying something from Word into the content area over here, please use the paste as plain text tool or paste from Word tool.
I would rather use the paste as plain text as it strips all unwanted code from any other program. Remember, you're writing text in here that are, that is web friendly. So once I've entered text in here, I can use a number of different tools such as the link tool. Once I highlight a bit of text, I can use the link tool and various other tools as required. So this is quite a handy way of updating uh, text in a Joomla website. So once we have edited text or added text into a into a particular page of the site over here. All we need to do is either click the apply tab which will save the article and bring you back into the WYSIWYG editor or the save tab which will save the whatever changes you've made to that art that page and bring you back out of out of it into the article manager section of Joomla and if you go back to the front end and refresh your page you will see that that is the bit of text that we've just entered so updates to the system is absolutely live we encourage visitors to log into the system and have two pages open one to access the back end and one to view the front end. Every time you make us apply a change or save a change, pop back to the front end and make sure that everything is displaying in the right place. And once you have made a change, click the Save tab and never be afraid to review what you have updated. And that's it for a basic change on a Joomla website. Please check our other tutorials as I will be going over how to update images in a Joomla page and how to create links also in a basic Joomla page. Thanks for joining me. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. This is Joseph from thirddesign.com. Thanking you. Bye-bye.